Hello, this is Dr. McCullough, and today I'd like to talk to you about a really important topic, and that is weight loss. And this is so important because so many people are challenged with extra weight. In the United States, that's two out of every three people. That's a lot of people. And anyone with, who has extra weight and extra body fat is increased risk for health diseases and complications, which is why we're so concerned about it, because it's going to increase the risk for chronic degenerative diseases and decrease lifespan. And uh, if you've been on the site for a while, it's no mystery as to some of these issues, but let me just review some of the highlights of them for you. Uh, recently, I actually came to the belief and understanding that the primary reason that's contributing to this obesity epidemic is fructose. And that's because in the mid-70s, scientists developed the uh, capacity and ability to actually cheaply produce it and extract it from corn in the, pro in the form of high fructose corn syrup. So as a result, it's really cheap and food processors put it in everything to the point where it is now the number one source of calories in the United States is from fructose. So it's no mystery if this is the primary way we're getting our calories that it shouldn't have some impact on our health, and it does. And metabolically, it's significantly different than regular sugar or glucose or dextrose. So, uh, and if, if you're curious about that, I would just uh, use our search engine to find more information. But fructose is a big issue, so you really want to stay away from that. But not only fructose, but all sugars, any processed foods, any grains, especially if you have a child with weight, will tend to increase your insulin resistance and leptin resistance, and as a result, make it more difficult to burn body fat. So clearly, the most important strategy you can have, no question about it, is the foods that you are using, the ones that you're selecting, you just stay away from the breads, the pastas, the rice, the cereals, the potatoes, the corn. Those are the foods that are going to cause your insulin levels to go up. So once you've got that under control, then at that point, you integrate exercise. And exercise will be massively important for helping you improve this, but it, it, was, it will be virtually useless without the proper use of diet. Now, the best exercises are not the ones you typically think of and the, the ones that most people do, which is the cardio. Well, it has some benefits. Clearly, the, the more beneficial components are going to be these high-intensity peak eight type exercises and strength training. That combination will actually increase your muscle mass, lower your percentage of body fat, and help you attain the body fat percentage that you were designed to have. So those are the two powerful strategies that you really need to integrate to optimize your weight. Now, if you're interested in some other supplemental approaches, for a, for a while now, we've promoted a supplement called Biothin. And Biothin, for those of you who aren't familiar with it, is a supplement that primarily, well, has a number of ingredients, but one of the, the, the most significant ones is a supplement called Fucoxanthin. And it's, it's a mouthful, but basically that's a carotenoid that's extracted from brown seaweed that helps uh, burn body fat. And it, it increases the metabolic metabolism to do this. And it also, because it's an antioxidant, it's, it pr provides beneficial protection for many of the cells. And it's somewhat similar to astaxanthin, but this fucoxanthin has been shown to be particularly useful in helping people achieve their ideal body weight. Uh, now, this fucoxanthin is also com com uh, used with other ingredients and herbs like hudia, hudia extract, which is an, uh, an African plant that has actually been shown to uh, suppress your appetite. But there's a number of other ingredients in this. But, but the exciting component is that we recently added a very new player on the market, on another herb from Africa, which is called Ervingia, which has actually been shown to be useful for leptin resistance. In fact, a recent 10-week uh, study showed that they were able to have people lose 28 pounds of weight uh, in, in that time frame and uh, really be a beneficial aid to helping them to achieve their ideal body weight. So ideally, you, you know, you're going to want to implement the health strategies that I mentioned at the beginning, which is you know, paying very careful attention to the food you're eating in conjunction with the high-intensity exercise program. But the uh, use of these aids can facilitate and catalyze and allow you to adopt that process much easier than you would normally. So. Uh, you know, really achieving your ideal body weight is a goal that, you know, all of us really want for a whole variety of reasons. So if uh, this is a challenge for you, as it is for most of us, then I would strongly uh, encourage you to consider uh, using this if you're unable to get the results that, you, that you're seeking to do with, with the current strategy. So hopefully uh, this will be a good resource for you and those you love to continue to take control of your health.